Hi, I'm Jeff Shoup, and we're getting down to the brass tacks and hard facts of doing your homework on your fire department for your fire control system. Fire hose, fire nozzle research. When a fire department is conscientious enough to make the push in that direction, they need to do their own homework. And what I mean by, by saying doing your own homework, what that means is you've got to look at your apparatus. You've got to look at your fire attack delivery system. You have to look at how many people you have in this apparatus, what kind of hose you plan to use, and what kind of nozzles. And it all sounds good when we're reading it from a book and so forth, or we're figuring out formulas and, and trying to determine, yeah, if we buy this, we'll flow this much water. No, homework is where we get a flow meter and we work with our equipment. It's always easy for someone to come into your department and say, hey, buy this, buy this, do this, do that. They leave town and you're stuck with something that doesn't work as planned. So when we say do your own homework, Look at things like your operating pressures in your pumps. The operating pressure in the pump is one thing, the plumbing in the pump is another thing. So for fire departments that run something like uh, an SOP that says we're gonna operate our pumps at 115, 120, or 125 pounds preset pressure, you can have a great hose delivery system and nozzle, but if you're not pumping it through that plumbing in that pump, you're not gonna get the flow. This is where the flow meters come in to help you understand that, gee, that pressure and this system isn't working as planned. What does it take to get that flow that we desire or that we should have you know, on our attack hose line? 